Welcome back to more Men of Valor. Last time we left here, we were pushing our way to the Arvin base through the city of Hui, pushing out Viet Cong. We took out a tank and a tank crew. That was fun, that was exciting. We met Leroy Jenkins, who is still with us. Somewhere. And now we are actually pushing our way towards the Arvin base. It is not too far away, I believe. We've just mowed down at least six NVA troops in this corridor alone in the first 35 seconds of the video. So let's see what surprises this mission gives us. It's obviously, if there's any, any. Whoa! Look at the amount of NVA over there! Look at the amount of them! Holy crap! That's a lot of NVA. That's probably the most NVA we've seen in one place in this entire Let's Play. And you know what that means? It means sniping time. They're just gonna get destroyed by my sniper. But I'm kind of running low on ammo for it, so I'm gonna try and use some frag grenades instead, since they're all grouped quite close together. Can't tell if these grenades are being effective, so I'm gonna swap over. Jesus, I can't even peek my head out out the rubble for a second. Oh yes! If only I had more snipe. I just had eight shots in a row. And each one of them killed a Viet Cong. Probably should have used my sniper to take out that goddamn machine gun nest, but. I guess my Type 56 does the job just as well. There's another guy hiding in there in that window. Oh! it's a lot of guys. They really don't want us to progress any farther than this, so the Arvin base must just be really close. Okay, I need a lot of health. Thankfully, there's a lot of damn bodies for me to search. I swear there was more, I killed more NVA than what's here. Okay, back to full health. Great stuff. Oh, and look, there's the Arvin base. That is definitely the Arvin base. Nope, oh, that's a friend. It's definitely the base. Let's get to it. Help the Arvin repel the NVA assault. Let's flank some dudes. The music for this section is quite cool, I will say that. The music is quite cool. We've got NVA on the left and right flanks. Two bunkers over there in that position. The Arvin base is heavily besieged, but that's what Dean Shepard is here for. Now that he is here, everything's going to be fine. <coughs> okay. Whoa! Dude, dude, what the frick? That was an RPG guy right there. Now, you don't actually want to do what I'm doing. You kind of want to get yourself over to the Arvin baseline as quickly as you can. It's what you want to do. You don't want to hang about this little opening here because you're ultimately not going to get much progress. And there's medkits and ammo over in the Arvin base. So once you get there, you're pretty much set up to repel the assault. Got to be careful about getting over there though. Got to make sure that you get guys on your flank like I did not do before moving, stupidly enough. But, we're back. And I obviously when I spawned in again, all those bodies I used to get the health were gone, so I had to kind of work with a lot less health than I did my first attempt, which is infuriating. But now I'm back to full health when I have an RPG. Gonna use the RPG to blow the hell out of the machine gun nest that's pounding us. There we go. See, that is so easy. Why couldn't you Arvin guys have just done that? Like, you just would have had so much better time of it if you just done that in the first place. Oh, 
Oh, there's an army guy right this guy right there. Right up to our lane. Right. Guy right down there. Oh no, that's an ally. I have no idea what an ally is doing all the way over there, but Oh well, they're over there. They can do what they want. That was an RPG. That was nice. Oh, I keep on shooting my own guys every video. That's a grenade. I gotta get away from that. Wait, I see another guy up there. I think I got him. We're being hit. Holy crap! That was a lot of damage. That was like more than that was like that was like three fourths of my health. Oh, and I just got hit again. So all that health I recovered is gone. Don't even know what the hell it was. It must have been an RPG. Let's see if I can blow him up. No, I can't blow that specific one up, unfortunately. What about that middle one? Maybe it needs to be in the middle one, though. Nope, I was a little bit off on my aim there. I kind of aimed a little bit too low. Better. But still can't blow him up like I could the other things, unfortunately. There must be only certain things you can blow the hell up with the RPGs. Okay. Let's just shoot the guy. I mean, that works as well. Shooting the guy does work. He's still alive though. What the hell? I definitely shot him. Oh my crap. I'm almost dead. So this is a little bit hectic, this little section here. You are surrounded, you'll have hundreds of NBA rushing you. I think we're oof, crack, crying out loud. They're crack shots. Don't even know how I managed to get that guy. I'm running out of medkits though, I need to be careful. Right, what's the plan now guys? What are we doing now? There is a turret you could use, but I think you end up being more of a target when you're in the turret. So I te personally don't like using turrets as much. Right. Where's the NVA now? I actually don't see any. I might just be dumb, right? There's no NVA there. Oh no, there he is. And... Tank. How do I know this tank is here? Because it killed me before. So you want to RPG the hell out of that tank. First thing you want to do is RPG the hell out of it and destroy it before it even gets any close to you. Do not want that thing tearing you up. Because it will tear you up. Holy crap, that's an NBA. Oh my... That was so close. So... Fucking close. Sergeant Shepard, on behalf of myself, my command, and the Republic of Vietnam, I extend humble gratitude to you and your comrade for your assistance in the battle for the Citadel. The bravery you show in volunteering to aid us as well as the valor you display in your action on the battlefield will always be remembered by my countrymen. You will have our friendship for as long as the Republic stand. Sincerely, Captain Nguyen Van Bao. And that's us, so I'll see you guys next time.